So the pork belly fried rice could go up in price. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, welcome to another video. Uh, this time we will be discussing on uh, which items I am currently stockpiling before the current PTR is going live. One disclaimer though, which all the items that I'm going to name and that I'm buying, don't buy them as well because I did this video. I am no way a referrer for uh, good decisions. I'm just saying that this might be and please guys comment what you think Please comment what you think because uh, I, I love to I love to see your side of uh, and Your opinion of this so let's go right into it now the first one that uh, I want to point out is the armor fragments uh, They are of course for elemental aversion perk uh, this one are being dropped by all of the corrupted mobs uh, in New World uh, through all like uh, for instance in this video in Brimstone Sands uh, but you can get them in Midgard you can get actually you can get them from uh, level 32 monster corrupted right another thing that I uh, remembered uh, since we're dealing with intelligence based uh, weapons uh, therefore, the prices for the intelligence food will probably go up as well, right? We have a couple of them that are quite nice. So let's see if uh, somebody was doing some Ancho Masala Scorpion. And as well, we need to check the constitution food. So the pork belly fried rice could go up in price. <laughs> Let, let's see, pork, pork belly fried rice 20 gold a pop and Masala is 140 now this is actually cheaper than the fish sauce used in creating it one fish sauce is 240 gold and Anko Masala scorpion where there is also pastry crust all of those items are selling for 140 so whoever is making this is losing a hundred gold can I place a outrageous buy offer for this I wonder what's gonna happen so the other one is the timeless fire staff shard uh, you guys know what uh, shards are used for they are currently going for about 200 uh, gold. Place another... Or actually seven. Place them for three days and uh, see what happens. Now these will be probably used more as well with the Void Gauntlet. Since everything is going uh, towards the elemental base damaged, they don't cost much now, but they might quadruple or uh, go up in price quite a lot. Since if we check out the Red Sword Shard, right, uh, is a lot more expense, expense, expensier, or uh, Great Axe Shard. Now they all go for a really good price, right? Uh, that price went was even bigger before uh, we saw the videos from PTR and uh, start making conclusions uh, where this is going. Ladies and gentlemen, there we have it. There's probably tons of more items that you could potentially resell once the PTR goes live for the season pass. Um, these are just a couple of that I like to stockpile at the moment. I hope this video will help you, although I cannot guarantee that it will. But if you think that it will, please consider it uh, liking. Of course, you have to comment because uh, you have to say, dude, you're wrong. You're completely wrong. There's, there's not even one point that it holds any water here <laughs> and uh, yeah uh, a subscribe goes a long way for me uh, subscriptions means that I see you guys enjoy my content 
plus you can see the uh, next video in your uh, first uh, YouTube uh, feed page. So uh, I hope uh, and I wish you the best in the game and as well in your personal life. And until next time.